audacity, actually To really think I care that you're mad at me Well, you took a knife and put it in the back of me Love like a Shakespeare tragedy The alchemy of you and me So we're starting off this video lost in the middle of nowhere <laughs> So me and Godri, our initial plan was to be at this lake, start the video off there. You know, nice and dandy, right? We got kayaks in the back, really sweet. I guess, what did we do? You took the wrong turn or what? I think we took the wrong turn. I've been here a bunch, but I guess I forgot how to get here. Yeah, so this is what it's looking like. Like, pretty much middle of nowhere, dude. There's a couple horses out there. That's pretty much all life that's out here at this point. So, um, a little off-roading with the truck a little bit. But I guess you need to get a little dirt on the tires. It's all good. But right now, we're going to update you guys if anything changes or if we're still freaking lost. Alright guys, we just made it to Skagway Lake, correct? Lake? Reservoir. reservoir? Everything in Colorado is a reservoir. Okay, got you. So, this right here is what it's looking like. Super sick. Got the two kayaks right here from, uh, you know, Dodger Productions bringing that down. <laughs> about to shoot up the drone in a bit, you know, get some nice scenic going. But it was actually, how long did it take us to get out here on this dirt road? 20 minutes? Yeah. 20 minutes? Little, we eventually uh, found our way out. We're at, like, we were going the right way the whole time. Then, like, we thought we got lost, so we turned around, and then we got, it, like, we had no service for our cell phones whatsoever. Eventually we got service. Turns out we were going the right way, so we flipped it around again. And uh, this is where we're at. Super high up at the mountains, huh? Oh yeah. So we're out here on the lake. Uh, we switched to a GoPro because Randy didn't want to bring his big camera out. Makes perfect sense. Uh, you can probably see him in the background. Hopefully everything comes out good on this. Um, we tried to send it to the other end of the lake, but it's super windy. So there's like eight inch little waves. And then when you're in a kayak, it's kind of brutal. So we came back by where we launched the kayaks. It's nice and protected in a little cove here. Try a little more fishing, see if we can get some more footage. So. You fly fish? All right, guys, we just got done. Thanks to Godrew for letting us use his kayaks out here. But super epic. Look at the freaking paddle right here. The bull looks absolutely sick. You know, the dirty truck was worth the drive, honestly, because the views were absolutely phenomenal. Like, damn. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out from the front. guys so where we were today um, it's like super west of Colorado Springs where we usually are on the complete other side of the mountain range uh, if you take a look here Big that's pass. the back side of the mountain range that we uh, usually see in the videos so that's pretty cool um, west there's a lot of like super old little mining towns uh, for example Victor which is a town that we were kind of by um, at the reservoir and we got a couple shots of like just the history of the mining that happened here. Uh, just a cool little, little fun fact of Western Colorado. Guys, basically that right there is this solid, solid piece. It looks like this mountain or hill, right? But it's actually just crumbled up rocks and Godry said it might be from the mining. So it's absolutely crazy. It's just a whole like hillside made of rock and like big piece to small piece. It's crazy. Rats in the bank, uh, that uncle blanks, uh, 
in parking lot, mm. smoking on stank, mm. other words dank, mm. used to drink drink, mm. yeah. big and I think, mm. yeah. I get the brain, mm. yeah. I who's the blame, diamonds on chain, look at the veins, Vampire man, uh, diamonds on frame, Cartier things. Ooh. You look at the stands, Ooh. yellow laces in the vans. Pants came from Japan, Ooh. bitches way about a friend. Whoa, pants came from Japan, Ooh. Uh. shirt came straight from France. Ooh. Ooh. Everybody do my dance, hey. Ooh. Babbage on me in the stands, Ooh. Yeah. but not talking about no socks. Yo, what is going on, guys? I just got home from the freaking gym and I actually had a package waiting for me at the mail from my protein so we're gonna go ahead and open that up I can find my scissors right, here we go so like I said package from my protein order some stuff from them uh, about a week ago and uh, I know it's gonna come in multiple packages but I wanted to see what this one is and then of course I'll update you guys on what the future pack packages are gonna be and it appears that this one's all protein by the looks of it got like multiple sample packs pretty much these are all half pound bags this is going to be salted caramel natural strawberry vanilla another vanilla chocolate brownie and mocha pretty excited for this one for some reason like i'm not a big coffee fan but like lately i've been having like what is it like vanilla bean frappuccino from Starbucks? And God, extremely good. Or the caramel frappuccino. And it has like a slight coffee taste, and I've been liking that like hint of coffee. Not pretty, not like the whole black coffee thing. But it's decent, it's a decent taste to it. As of right now, as you see, this hair is just looking unacceptable. So I'm about to go get this uh, thing tamed up really quick. Of course, I'm gonna catch a shower. Just because the leg workout was a decent one. And um, uh, we'll see you guys in a bit. You guys saw me scoop out some uh, pre workout. So I got Aries, this white powder right here. Apple teeny flavor, and then I got this uh, woke as fuck pre workout. It's like um, like blood punch or something like along those lines. And then I also have this impact away protein vanilla like sample sort of pack. I'm gonna give that to my barber Kenny because he's actually like on a journey of like a transformation of losing weight and stuff. So I'm gonna be doing that. And uh, actually, like if he lets me, I'm gonna ask him right now. I'm gonna post like a picture of his transformation. He's absolutely epic. He's lost a pretty good amount of weight in a decent amount of time. So I'm actually pretty excited. And I'm looking actually, I would really love to help him like with macros and stuff like that. And he's willing to learn. That's the cool thing too. So I'm about to go in there, grab a haircut, and then um, grab a haircut or get a haircut. And then I'll see you guys in a bit. Dude. Back on the channel. Lot, Alright guys, right here at the sushi slash poke restaurant here. What's it called? Sawara? Sawara? Sawara. So what you pronounce it right there. And um, pretty much got a sushi burrito, spicy tuna roll, poke bowl, some like tuna seared. What'd you get? Dynamite roll. So yellow tail roll. Burrito. How could I make sense when I got me on 